Hey everybody, Rose Donahue here, and we are at Clexicon, a convention for LGBTQ women and allies in media and entertainment, taking place at the Tropicana in Las Vegas, Nevada. We're on the show floor right now. We're going to talk to a few of our guests, panelists, and see what's going on. You may or may not know that cosplay is an important part of Clexicon. So, Marissa, what's it been like wearing this outfit through the convention? I got a lot of attention, but a lot of people know that I'm Octavia, which is kind of cool, because going into the fifth season of The 100, she kind of changes a lot, so yeah. We're here now with Zara Berry, the executive editor of Go Magazine and one of the panelists at Clexicon this year. How has the convention been for you? The convention has been completely amazing. I went last year and last year was fantastic, but this year is so much better. What is your favorite thing about being a panelist? I just love being able to like actually reach the readers of the magazine and like ask them what they're interested in and find out because I think as a writer you have a responsibility to serve your audience so it's like I'm actually with the audience and I'm able to be like what's, what's important to you? What do you want us as journalists to write? What does it feel like attending an event as an ally that is geared towards LGBTQ women? You know it gives me great joy to be around all these people and just seeing like and learning through what experiences they go through and how they're unrepresented through our pop culture and I really want to see much more representation in our TV culture. I am here with Crystal Vailula, an artist exhibiting here at Clexicon. Where are you visiting us from? I'm from San Francisco. We're so lucky you're here. We have your art around the show floor and at your booth right now. Could we see a piece? So this is uh, part of my queer, queer movie stills series and I just um, queered a bunch of iconic scenes from different movies. Yeah. That's awesome. And what inspired your style and for you to queer these different movies? Um, I just feel like there's underrepresentation of queer love stories in film, so I wanted to make it up in my imagination, put it on paper, and um, I wanted to stick with a colorful palette to um, show joy and happiness, and also um, I wanted to stick with unrealistic colors for skin tones to not assign race so that more people could identify with it. What do you th would you say, in a sentence, is Clexicon, and what, why does it matter? I think Clexicon is giving us hope for representation for the future and also highlighting the representation that we see now and so we can feel um, like queer people in general can feel seen and part of a community. We're here with Kristen Baker, the creator, founder of Tello Films. How has the conference been for you so far? Clexicon is, I think, one of the highlights of my year. I, it's my second time at the conference. We were the first company to reach out to Clexicon for a sponsorship year one. Wow. Um, I knew this was going to be something special, and I think, I think it is, and I think it will just continue to be even more special and more fantastic. So I'm so excited to be here and be a part of it. Yeah. And, and support lesbian content and the fandom. Is there a tip that you can give to someone who's going to come to Clexicon next year? Just experience the vibe and recognize that everyone around you is an absolute advocate. Um, I would also say like the panels are so diverse and amazing. Find the ones that speak to you that will inspire you and go to them. Um, and, and we can kind of be shy sometimes, but I would say do what you can to meet people because this is your tribe. And these are the people who love the things that you love. And, and in that we support one another and help um, support the people who again make the content. And then if you're inspired, you can also make your own. What an amazing day at Clexicon. I feel so lucky to have spoken to panelists, visitors, guests. It was amazing. Thanks for tuning in.